Exporting raw data from your videos. This video will show you how to put unprocessed raw data from your video into an Excel file. To begin, click on the File menu at the top, choose Export Raw Data, choose the increment that you would prefer. 1 second, 1 millisecond, 60 seconds, and many in between are available. You can toggle on and off the drawings label, segment duration, transcription, and notes. Give your file a title, click Save, OK, and you'll find it's been exported. When you open it, you'll find that it looks like this. On top are label name, label number, labeler name, the person, labeler number, also the number of the person. In this case, it was only one person. We also have the number of instances coded. We have the total time of those instances and the percentage of the video that they make up. In this case, it looks like it was a teaching lesson. We have interesting as a label, question, student response, teacher response, and we can see that our timelines are now oriented going down. Zero time is at the top, and time flows downward, and you'll find your, your transcripts at the right. If you have a project with multiple users, multiple coders, the process is the same to generate the export file. We'll take a look at how the data renders. And here we're looking at the raw data of multiple users, and you can note that the code or label is on the very top, and the labeler name is next. As we scroll down, we can compare one rater's timelines and codes to that of another. With this data, you're now ready to analyze further. You can do things like histograms of relative frequency versus time, uh, relative number coding a given instance, and more. Remember also that we do have inter-rated reliability, overlap statistic, and um, cross-coding frequencies as built-in statistical functions, so do check out our other videos on those.